oysters. Krasostria iridale, locally known as talaba, is just one of the many species of oysters being cultured in the tropics. They are considered as a gourmet and luxury food item in developed countries, but also as an affordable seafood delicacy in developing countries. Oysters are among the most in-demand bivalves in the Philippines because of their affordability. They are served in households, in small seafood restaurants, and in five-star hotels. Aside from utilizing their flesh as food, oyster shells are also used as settlement substrate where young spats of oysters and even other mollusks attach. Their shells are also used in the production of calcium carbide, lime, poultry grit, fertilizer, cement, and jewelry. Oyster production worldwide peaked in 2013 at about 5 million metric tons, with most of the products coming from Asia. The top 10 oyster producing countries are China, Japan, Korea, Taiwan, Thailand, Philippines, Indonesia, Hong Kong, India, and Turkey. In Southeast Asia, the top three producing countries are Thailand, Philippines, and Indonesia. In the Philippines, oyster production peaked in 2010, with most of the oysters coming from the Western Visayas region. In the region, most of the oysters are produced in the province of Capiz, known as the seafood capital of the Philippines. Oysters may come as clusters or individuals. The type of oyster we harvest depends on the culture method. The traditional way of growing oysters is by using the stake method, tires attached to fixed bamboo structures, oyster shells suspended from fixed bamboo structures, tires suspended from floating rafts, oyster shells suspended from floating rafts. All these methods produce oyster clusters. The Philippine Council for Agriculture, Aquatic and Natural Resources Research and Development of the Philippine Department of Science and Technology and the Aquaculture Department of the Southeast Asian Fisheries Development Center teamed up in an oyster project which aims to produce good quality individual slipper oysters Crasostria iridale. An experiment conducted in the town of New Washington, province of Aklan, compared existing oyster culture practices with new methods. In the study, oysters were grown differently using pouches and trays. At the same time, another set of oysters were grown using the traditional methods. After six months, Oysters grown in the new method using pouches and trays gained significantly more body weight. There was also a remarkable increase in their flesh weight at harvest. Considering the economics, the old methods involved a lower production cost, but oysters produced are sold only per sack or per kilo. Meanwhile, Oysters produced using the new methods can be sold by the piece. The study has shown that the new methods using pouches and trays produce individual oysters which are larger and heavier than those produced using the traditional methods which are clustered, smaller, and lighter. Based on this study, the use of pouches in oyster culture is the best and cheapest way for the Philippines to produce Class A individual oysters.